Hey everybody, my name is Aaron King with Cutting Edge Homes uh, and ICFGuru.com. You might have seen some of my YouTube videos about ICF. That's generally what we talk about. Uh, today we're at a big, we're, we were gonna pour it today. The guys aren't gonna quite get it ready because we had a little snow last night. But talking tall walls, you know, you, you guys have seen me do up to 20 feet in one pour. These walls are gonna be about 12 feet on this lift. Then this is gonna get a light deck roof over it and this entire shop is about 65 by 75 shop goes up another 20 feet and it has a light deck roof so it's an absolutely massive project but nice straight walls easy to do and we're using the fab form system for everything it's an incredibly easy system to keep everything straight when you're going tall i don't think there's a more flexible system out there so really cool we'll walk around the thing kind of look at a few of the details real quick so guys, you might remember from about two weeks ago, we did the one where uh, John Martin and his wife had DIY'd their own. And I was trying to show you the bucks because I use a lot of Fox bucks, the all styrofoam and plastic web. But these Gorilla bucks, we ran into a deal where this was eight inches for the basement, eight inch core. And we only had six inch Fox bucks, but we had eight inch Gorilla bucks. I want to kind of show you the cross section. That's why the thermal bridge is not very bad with these. And you get a lot more structural stability with these than you will with the all styrofoam buck. So I kind of like them. We got a couple garage doors down here that got big spans. We're still gonna use the Fox Bucks above grade, but down here, we're using these bucks and they're great. So, All right, so guys, you can kind of see how we address steps in the footings and you know the zons are basically the whaler bracket. The thing about the fab form system that we like, it's, it's horizontal whalers. Every other bracing system I've seen with ICF has vertical bracing, but it leaves you like six or seven feet between them and that you can get little bows that you can't take out after the fact with the whaler, you can get a completely straight wall at the top uh, with a string line, it's great. Um, so these are the Zats, these are the, um, the walk plank scaffolding that can hold a two by four here if you need a railing. Um, funny thing, when, when we first started dealing with fab form, they wanted to order some of these. I didn't really want them because we've always just framed them out of two by fours and they ordered them for me. I was like, oh, these are gonna be too expensive. They have been the greatest thing. I mean, they're so fast. I probably saved more than I spent on them in labor in a couple of pours. So they're awesome. They're super sturdy. They're safer than, than homemade ones. We just we just used a couple of Zevlers because we had a corner that was down a little bit. Um, really, the whole suite of products is just, it's, it's all incredibly well thought out. I think the guys at Fabform, you know, they don't do blocks themselves so they just make everybody else's blocks better um, which is what I really like about them so. all right guys I hope you guys enjoyed the walkthrough and uh, be sure to follow my YouTube at cutting edge homes with three exclamation points I'm gonna be doing a lot more of this stuff a lot more light deck as we're just getting into that a lot more in addition to all the pool stuff we do and we've got an amazing project coming up next summer in Angel Fire New Mexico that is a complete ICF build including an indoor pool ICF all the way to the roof. So it's gonna be a really cool follow uh, and we've got tons of cool content coming up next year between pools and that project. It's gonna be a, a full year of ICF stuff to follow. So see you guys next time.